Jake Paul has officially retired. The thing with Jake Paul is that you've got to take everything with a pinch of salt because this guy changes his mind more times. I change girls. If he's the, the, the Woodley punch is like, damn, man, I, I never want to feel that again. Or he's just trolling again. Just keep people talking like me. Like, was the Woodley fight so hard that he's actually retiring now? He doesn't want to feel that pain again. After the post-fight interview, his reaction did kind of look weird in a way because he said, oh, I want to take a, I, I want to reevaluate and think what I'm going to do next, which I was a bit surprised. And I was sort of thinking maybe he won't be fighting more like tough opposition because he was enjoying knocking out Nate Robinson, Anderson Gibb and Ben Askren in one round, like these tomato cans in one round. But when he fought a live dog and Tyrone Woodley, you can actually punch and Jake Paul's literally running the whole fight. He's like, oh shit, I never want to do that again. So maybe with him saying reevaluate probably meant fight more, more bums, go back to fighting bums. But he knows people won't be interested in him fighting on the more tomato cans because you only have to improve your opponents. You can't go backwards. Otherwise, people won't really care. So yeah, and that's probably why he's saying I'm retired because no one's really going to care. And once you're in a high, because that fight, Tyron Woodley Jake Paul was huge, was huge. And once you're in that high, you don't want to be going down. You don't want to be going backwards. So him say fight another like Dylan Dennis, even though that fight will probably be a bit big. But people will still say that Dylan can't box. He's a wrestler. He's a bum. He's a clown. He's just a TikToker. So your comment down below, you lots of thoughts on this. Do you love think Jake Paul's actually retired or he's just talking bollocks again? Like, comment, subscribe for more bollocks and peace.